We are now only just days away from the Payback Premium Live event as we welcome you to another edition of Monday Night Raw. We come to you tonight from Mobile, Alabama and in our main event this evening, it will be Braun Strowman going one-on-one -on -one with the Samoan Submission Machine, Samoa Joe, following their confrontation last week here on the Red Brand. But we kick things off with women's division action. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one goal. Introducing first from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. Bianca Belair is set to face Io Shirai this Sunday at Payback for the Raw Women's title. But tonight, she has to team with Io Shirai in a tag team matchup against the Iconics. Can Bianca Belair and Io Shirai coexist before their title match this Sunday at Payback? We are going to find out here tonight on Monday Night Raw as this show gets underway. Hell of a way to get things going. Here comes the genius of the sky, the Raw Women's Champion, Io Shirai. And her partner from Tokyo, Japan, the Raw Women's Champion, Io Shirai. Shirai was able to become the inaugural Raw Women's Champion of Universe Mode at the Elimination Chamber, where she walked out of the Elimination Chamber match with the gold. And she is fast approaching her very first title defense this Sunday at Payback. Can Io Shirai successfully defend her title? For the first time here in Universe Mode, we're going to find out at Payback. Women's Tag Team Action is on the way. Here come the Iconics. The Iconics now making their way down to the ring. And this could be one hell of an opportunity for the Iconics. They have the chance here this evening to knock off both the number one contender and the champion in the Raw Women's Division. Women's Tag Team Action will kick things off here tonight on this edition of Monday Night Raw. As WWE Payback is right around the corner. We are about to find out if Belair and Shirai can coexist here this evening before their title match this Sunday at Payback. And it looks like it will be Belair and Kay that start out this matchup for their respective teams. There's the bell run the way. And Belair trying to lift up Billy Kay, but Kay went right to the leg. Shot block to the leg and Billy Kay staying on Belair. Oh, but there's a kick from Belair. And now Bianca back to a vertical base, went for the full on. Kay saw it coming. And now here comes Billy Kay. Oh, with a backbreaker. Knee right to the spine. And now Bianca Belair sent into the corner of the Iconics tag made. Oh, and Belair head first off of Peyton Royce's boot. Peyton Royce now the legal competitor for the Iconics. As she looks for an STO, Belair with a counter, and there's a dragon suplex. 
Peyton Royce landing hold on her neck right there as the EST of WWE gets back into this matchup. Power slam. Into a standing moonsault, nobody home. Royce was able to evade that standing moonsault. And now look at these kicks right to the skull. One to the midsection, looking for a DDT. Belair trying to fight it, and she does. There's the forearm. Royce is stunned as she gets sent off the ropes. Right into the spine buster. Cover by Belair. And a kick out at one. Elbow to the midsection there by Royce. And now Royce with a forearm smash of her own. Again, trying for that STO. Belair had a counter. Belair again looking for that forearm. Royce again with one of her own. And now Peyton Royce with a DDT right to the leg. And Peyton Royce continuing to go off to the foundation of the EST. Picking apart the leg of Bianca Belair. And this is a smart strategy by Peyton Royce as Belair kicks her away. Separation made. And now Bianca with another power slam to Peyton Royce. Frog splash. Is it enough to put down the Iconics? No, there's Billy Kay. Billy Kay short circuiting that pinfall attempt as she gets pulled through the middle rope. And Belair with a clubbing blow there to the back. And Peyton Royce from behind with a backslide. Shoulders down for a one count. with a crossbody. She just wiped out Bianca. Can she follow it up? Spinning heel kick. Right to the chest. Is that enough to put down the number one contender? No. Kick out at two that time. And now Peyton Royce consents. The end may be near for Belair, but there's a reversal. And all went for the forearm again. Royce with a kick and a chop. And more kicks now to the skull as well. Belair is in trouble. She gets sent into the corner. More kicks from Peyton Royce. And now from behind, reverse DDT. Belair just got planted. And now Royce trying to pick apart the arm. Arm oh, ringer by Peyton Royce. And Royce shouting at the crowd here tonight as she delivers that drop kick. Belair is in trouble. But now Belair going off to Peyton Royce's arm. And the tag is made. In comes the Oshirai. In comes the champion with a drop kick. And Peyton is able to make the tag back to Billy Kay. Kay went for the forearm. Here comes Io Shirai. Frankensteiner. Into a standing moonsault. Cover by Shirai. And Peyton Royce breaks it up. Io Shirai distracted. And she wipes out Royce. And Billy Kay from behind. No Shirai is able to land on her feet. Right into a backslide. Backslide by Shirai for a two cow. And Oweo tried to roll through. Corner knee went to the skull instead. And now Billy Kay. No reversal by Shirai. Into the reverse DDT. And now Kay pit back up to her feet. Io Shirai with more strikes. And now K sent off the ropes. Through the legs goes EO into the Hurricane Rana. And EO Shirai's feeling good, but Billy Kay's trying to make a tag right here. Can she make it to Royce? Yes, she can. The tag was made. And Shirai able to evade the clothesline. EO Shirai setting up Royce for the Koji Clutch. The Koji Clutch is locked in, but there's Billy Kay. 
once again saving the matchup. Kay sent to the outside and now Io Shirai has a perfect opportunity here to put this matchup away. But there's a counter from Peyton Royce. And now Royce taking it to Io Shirai. Neck break off. That could be it. What a win this could be for Peyton Royce. But there's a kick out at two. And now Royce looking to put away the World Women's Champion. The Io Shirai with the Fireman's Carry takeover. And now Royce sent into the corner. Back elbow, no. Reversal by Royce. Into the crossbody. Cover on Shirai. Shoulders down. And there's another kick out at two. Jawbreaker by Io Shirai. Shirai with a massive slap. And now Royce sent into the corner. European uppercut, back elbow. And Shirai with the Tiger fake kick. Right around the ring post. Springboard drop kick. And Shirai's building some momentum right now. Io Shirai may be about to put this matchup away. Royce is in the drop zone. And the genius of the sky is about to fly. My goodness, what a moonsault. Cover. Shirai and Belair get the win. Here are your winners. Bianca Belair and Io Shirai. Shirai and Belair build momentum heading into their title match against one another this Sunday at Payback. We are back here on Monday Night Raw and moments ago it was the in-ring debut to Universe Mode for Omos. And off that massive boot to the face of Lee Brian Kendrick, Omos would set Kendrick up for the tree slam. And then one foot on the chest of Kendrick would lead to the win for Omos. Shirai and Belair were able to coexist here tonight, but this Sunday it will be a different story when they battle each other for the Raw Women's title. There is the violent artist set for action. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Vancouver, British Columbia. Weighing in at 200 pounds. Kyle O'Reilly. We have not seen Kyle O'Reilly since he competed in the United States Championship Tournament almost two months ago now. And he was unsuccessful in his matchup with the Celtic warrior Sheamus, who as we know went on to win the United States Championship Tournament to become the inaugural United States Champion here in Universe Mode. O'Reilly looks to rebound here tonight from his loss in that tournament as he comes up against Austin Theory. What a matchup this is going to be. Kyle O'Reilly taking on Austin Theory in one-on-one -on -one competition. And you just know that Johnny Gargano is going to be at ringside. How will that affect this matchup? We're about to find out. As O'Reilly looks ready to go. Here comes Austin Theory. And there is Johnny Gargano as well. Accompanying him to ringside. And his opponent, accompanied by Johnny Gargano, representing the way from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Austin Theory. Well, this Sunday at Payback, the way 
is going to be taking on the Viking Raiders for the WWE Tag Team Titles. So tonight, Austin Theory can answer momentum for his team if he can knock off Kyle O'Reilly. And as I mentioned a moment ago, Kyle O'Reilly could really use a win here tonight as well. As he is looking to rebound from his loss in the United States Championship Tournament. So here we go, O'Reilly versus Theory, and we are underway. And the tie-up will begin proceedings as Austin Theory comes out of the tie-up with that standing drop kick. And now he's looking for a suplex. O'Reilly lands on his feet, and now from behind, there's one from Kyle O'Reilly. A German suplex to be precise. And now Kyle O'Reilly, oh wait a minute, look at this, into the arm breaker. Cross arm breaker here by O'Reilly. And already Austin Theory's in some trouble as he battles the violent artist, but he is able to escape. And oh, what a shot there from Theory. Big kick to the spine. And now Austin Theory going off to the arm. And there's some arrogance on display. As O'Reilly is sent into the corner. Pump kick by Austin Theory. And Gargano is pleased with what he's seen thus far. But Kyle O'Reilly trying to battle back. Here comes the strikes. And now he targets the arm. O'Reilly working on the arm of Austin Theory. Rolling elbow, my God. Theory's in some trouble. As now Kyle O'Reilly delivers the Tiger Suplex. Here's a bridge, and Austin Theory stays in it. Went for the roundhouse kick. There's an open palm strike and a shot by Austin Theory. And now Theory with a devastating power bomb. And just like that, Theory's back in control. As look at this strength. Deadlifting up Kyle O'Reilly for that gut wrench power bomb. And there's a standing shooting star press to follow. Theory into the cover. Shoulders down for a one count. And Theory, oh wait a minute, Kyle O'Reilly with a kick and another one. Here comes Kyle O'Reilly. Another striking combination right into the brain buster. And this could be it for Austin Theory, but he manages to stay alive. Jawbreaker by Theory. Went for the drop kick this time, O'Reilly was able to dodge. And now again, the strikes from the violent artist. Kyle O'Reilly beating the hell out of Theory right now. Look at these wicked forearms. And Johnny Gargano's concerned. He's distracting Kyle O'Reilly. Oh, and that allowed Theory to deliver a super kick. And now O'Reilly set up and cornered. Is it enough? Austin Theory for the win. O'Reilly kicks out. And now Austin Theory went for the standing moonsault. No water in the pool. And this is now an opening for Kyle O'Reilly. Oh, and he goes right off the knee. And O'Reilly to the chest now of Austin Theory. Oh, O'Reilly handing it to Theory. Oh, as he buries the knee right to the midsection. And now Kyle O'Reilly may be thinking guillotine, but he can't lock it in. Austin Theory had the move scouted. Oh, and there's a clothesline in the corner. O'Reilly gets his arm slammed into the canvas. But there's a dragon screw leg whip. And oh, Gargano threw a chair into the ring as O'Reilly locks in the heel hook. Heel hook by Kyle O'Reilly. And the submission specialist looking to make Austin Theory tap out right here. But the boot will create separation. 
And now Austin Theory with some strikes of his own. There's another clothesline in the corner. But Austin Theory this time follows through with that running blockbuster. And now Theory looking for the ATL. Can he hit it? No. Kyle O'Reilly trying to block. And O'Reilly with some shots to the midsection. Oh, but there's another super kick by Austin Theory. Went for the drop kick again. O'Reilly with a counter, but Gargano with a distraction. And Theory took full advantage of it. Forearm right to the back of the skull. And now O'Reilly sent back into the corner. And oh, O'Reilly just dumped unceremoniously to the outside. The referee now beginning his count to 10. As Austin Theory will get O'Reilly back into the ring. And now Theory measuring his man. Theory slingshot, drop kick right to the chest. And Theory again looking for the ATL. But O'Reilly counters. And there's a full run right to the face. Kick to the midsection and now O'Reilly double on the hook suplex. He rolls it through into a second one. And the double on the hook face buster will connect as well. O'Reilly could be on the cusp of picking up the win. But Theory with a boot to the face. And now Austin Theory with a couple of strikes and a fisherman suplex. Standing moonsault this time he connects. Will it be enough to put down O'Reilly? No, not quite. This matchup will continue. O'Reilly is picked back to his feet. There's a shot right to the chest. And O'Reilly sent back into the corner once more. And what does Austin Theory have planned here? Rolling forearm. And Theory locking in the ankle lock. And now he grapevines it. Kyle O'Reilly's got nowhere to go. He is in trouble. The ankle lock is cinched in. But O'Reilly trying to escape it. And he does. The matchup rolls on again. As all. O'Reilly missed out. Austin Theory going to showcase his power now. What a power bomb! O'Reilly's foot's on the ropes. The referee doesn't see it. Oh, but O'Reilly will kick out anyway. And Austin Theory with some trash talk. O'Reilly's not going to stand for that. Oh, but there's a knee right to the midsection. And another drop kick by Austin Theory. And Theory going to head up top. High risk inbound. Gargano cheering him on. Austin Theory with a missile drop kick. And now Theory setting up Kyle O'Reilly. Brain Buster right onto the knee. Cover. Shoulders down. And oh, somehow, some way O'Reilly remains in this matchup. And there's a kick right to the face. Kyle O'Reilly goes off to the arm. And now Kyle O'Reilly looking for a net breaker. No, there's a forearm shot right to the back of the skull. There is a reason why they refer to Kyle O'Reilly as the violent artist. As he went to finish off Austin Theory right there. Theory with a back suplex. Oh, and there's a knee right to the skull. And again, Austin Theory with the deadlift gut wrench power bomb. And Theory once again to the high rent district. Missed out though on the elbow drop. And now Kyle O'Reilly rolls him through. Shoulders down on Austin Theory for the counter two. And now Theory with a jackknife cover. Shoulders down on O'Reilly for another two count. What a matchup. Oh, but Theory capitalising on the moment. ATL, he hit it. Theory into the cover. 
Shoulders down, Austin Theory puts down Kyle O'Reilly. What a matchup. Here is your winner, Austin Theory. Austin Theory gets some momentum heading into payback, but wait a minute, I don't think he's done. He is not done with Kyle O'Reilly. Kyle O'Reilly sent into the barricade. And Austin Theory punishing Kyle O'Reilly off to the matchup. There is no need for this, and there's another deadlift gut wrench power bomb. This time on the outside of the ring. And Theory's gonna leave Kyle O'Reilly laying. Well, still to come your way tonight here on Monday Night Raw on Main Event. We'll see Braun Strowman battle the Samoan Submission Machine, Samoa Joe, after their confrontation last week here on the Red Brand. We are back here on Monday Night Raw, and here comes the Samoan Submission Machine, Samoa Joe. And we will see Samoa Joe in action later on here tonight as he battles the monster among men, Braun Strowman, following their confrontation last week here on the Red Brand. But right now, I believe Samoa Joe has some words for the monster among men. We are about to hear from the Samoan submission machine right here on Monday Night Raw. The WWE Universe firmly behind Samoa Joe here tonight. Samoa Joe always is captivating on the microphone. And I'm sure he's going to be here again tonight. Let's hear what Samoa Joe has to say to Braun Strowman. Well, Samoa Joe going to keep it short and sweet here tonight. Well, moments ago here on Monday Night Raw, it was the Viking Raiders taking on Ross Lotharios. And off that devastating rolling elbow by Eric, Angel Garza would get hit with the running knee strike. And that would be the beginning of the end for Ross Lotharios. As Garza would then be sent into the corner for the tag to be made. And the Viking Raiders would set up Angel Garza for fallout. Humberto Carrillo would then get knocked off of the ring apron by Ibar, and that would lead to the one, two, and three. The Raiders were able to build momentum heading into payback live this Sunday, and the Raw Women's title will be defended this Sunday at payback by Io Shirai as she takes on Bianca Belair. The United States Championship will be defended by Sheamus, as he goes one-on-one -on -one with the phenomenal AJ Styles. The WWE Tag Team titles will be up for grabs as the Viking Raiders defend against the Way. And of course, the WWE Championship will be defended by Batista as he battles Braun Strowman. That is all coming your way this Sunday at Payback. Right now, though, it is time for our main event of the evening. As here comes the Samoan Submission Machine. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Huntington Beach, California. Weighing in at 282 pounds. Samoa Joe. 
Last week here on Monday Night Raw, Braun Strowman took on our truth in one-on-one -on -one competition. However, after the matchup had ended and Braun Strowman walked out with the victory, it was Samoa Joe that confronted the monster among men. Samoa Joe laid out the challenge to Braun Strowman, pick on somebody your own size, take me on and try me out. And Braun Strowman has, of course, accepted Samoa Joe's challenge. And tonight we have got this matchup for our main event of the evening between Samoa Joe and Braun Strowman. Here comes the monster among men. And his opponent from Cheryl Ford, North Carolina. Weighing in at 385 pounds, Braun Strowman! Braun Strowman will challenge for the WWE Championship this Sunday at Payback against the Animal Batista. But tonight he goes one-on-one -on -one with Samoa Joe as he looks to build momentum into his title matchup. What a main event we have got for you here this evening. Two Goliaths battling it out here tonight on the Red Brand. We have some Strowman fans in attendance, it seems. There's the bell. Here we go. And Samoa Joe White out of the gate went for the big boot. Braun Strowman able to counter, but there's a crossbody by Samoa Joe. Counter for counter early on. Oh, there's a knife edge shot, an open palm strike to Braun Strowman. And now Joe sends him off the ropes, went for the back elbow, Strowman able to avoid it. And now here comes Braun Strowman. Oh, Joe just got planted. Joe though able to kick Braun Strowman away. And now Strowman picked back to his feet. There's another open palm strike and another one. Oh, and Strowman just got slapped. Strowman now to the outside. Here comes Samoa Joe, like a freight train, my God. Strowman just got wiped out. And this is awesome chance already erupting as Strowman gets sent into the barricade. And Samoa Joe holding nothing back. Oh, he looks to teach Strowman a lesson here tonight. Strowman, it appears, has been bullying other superstars here on the roster. Apparently, he demanded matches with the likes of Tucker and R-Truth. And again, Strowman sent into the barricade. Five. Count of five from the official. These two have got to be careful. As Strowman is sent back into the ring. Samoa Joe in pursuit. Oh, and now Joe right off to the legs of the monster among men. And Samoa Joe with the reverse atomic drop. Big boot to the chest. And a sent on. Joe now the cover. Shoulders down on Strowman for the counter one. You're going to need to do a lot more than that to put down Strowman. There's an elbow to the midsection. A kick now from Strowman. And an uppercut. And a splash in the corner. Just like that, Strowman turns the momentum of this matchup around. And now Strowman setting up the choke slam. Samoa Joe with the back elbow and a super kick. My goodness. Wait a minute, though, Strowman's on the rope. Referee didn't notice, but it won't matter. As Strowman would power out at the counter one. There's a knee by Samoa Joe. Right to the skull of Strowman. And Samoa Joe now. Lifting Strowman back to his feet. Snapmare takedown. There's a shot right to the spine and a kick right to the face. Oh, and there's another back elbow to the midsection by Strowman. And Strowman with a DDT. Samoa Joe though right back up to his feet. 
And Strowman again with some devastating strikes. And now Joe sent into the corner. And Strowman with the knees right to the gut of Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe may be in some trouble right now. As Braun Strowman plants Joe spine first into the canvas. And now Strowman measuring Samoa Joe. Looking for that elevated triangle submission, but Joe had a reversal for it. And Joe now planting Strowman with the Uranagi. Is it enough for the win? Kick out at two. Not quite enough to put down Braun Strowman. But Samoa Joe looking for the Coquina Clutch. Can he get this locked in? No, Strowman with another elbow. And a running STO will follow it up. And oh, look at Strowman walking over Samoa Joe. And now Strowman trash talking Joe as well. Just to add insult to injury. Oh, what a suplex. And there's an elbow to the chest. Samoa Joe picked back up to a vertical base. And the monster among men sends him back into the corner. More elbows right to the skull. Oh, and there's a kick. And look at the arrogance from Braun Strowman. He's looking for the running power slam. Samoa Joe though, right to the gut. And a massive clothesline will knock down the monster. And now Joe into the Coquina Clutch. The Coquina Clutch is in. Braun Strowman now in trouble. Can Samoa Joe do what he said he'd do and put Strowman to sleep? It doesn't look like he will because Braun Strowman has created separation. And Strowman, oh, caught a shot there by Samoa Joe. And now here comes Joe with a DDT of his own. And there's an elbow to the chest of Strowman. And Joe said it's over. Samoa Joe looking for the Coquina Clutch again. Samoa Joe gets reversed and there goes Joe. Sent to the outside by Braun Strowman. Braun Strowman in pursuit, but Samoa Joe's already back to his feet. And Samoa Joe back on the offensive. Super kick, no Strowman caught the leg. Oh, and Samoa Joe just got leveled by that clothesline. Show gets sent into the barricade. The referee up to a count of three as Strowman delivers a boot right to the back of the skull. And now Strowman measuring Joe on the outside of the ring. Someone with Joe in trouble. There's the elevated triangle submission. Strowman's got it locked in. Samoa Joe could pass out right here on the outside. But Samoa Joe's fighting. Samoa Joe fighting the submission and he manages to escape. Strowman now back into the ring. As is Samoa Joe, but Joe heads up high. Missile drop kick. Strowman knocked off his feet. Samoa Joe into the cover. Shoulders down on Strowman for a two count. And Braun Strowman already back up to a vertical base. There's another open palm strike. And another DDT. And Strowman again went back to his feet. Joe looking for that big boot. Strowman from behind. Joe's tied up in the ropes and there's the reverse choke slam. Hand on the chest. Braun Strowman for the win. Oh my God, at the last possible second. Joe raises the shoulder. And now Strowman again measuring Samoa Joe. Looking for the running power slam. Show though, with a reversal. And now into the corner goes Strowman. It's a gory by Samoa Joe. Joe could be on the cusp of putting down the monster. 
looking for the Coquina clutch, but Strowman with a reversal. And now Strowman. Oh, choke slam. Choke slam to Samoa Joe. Strowman's not done. Went for the clothesline. Joe caught him out with the jawbreaker. Great counter. And now Samoa Joe going to send Strowman back into the corner. Samoa Joe, no, Strowman with the neck breaker. Again, these two going back and forth. Joe with a kick there in the midsection. And now Joe with another reverse atomic drop into the big boot. And the sent on. Samoa Joe stringing some more moves together in the hopes of putting Braun Strowman away. Strowman back in the corner. Oh, there's a headbutt by Joe. And now the face washes. Oh, the impact. Strowman could be out of it. Samoa Joe to the middle rope. Looking for the knee, Strowman got out of the way. And now Strowman launches Joe over his shoulders. And now Strowman deadlifting Samoa Joe onto his shoulder for the running power slam. Cover by Strowman. Strowman wins. Braun Strowman builds momentum, heading into payback. Here is your winner. Braun Strowman is victorious as he heads into his title match this Sunday with Batista. Samoa Joe getting back up to his feet now. And oh, wait a minute, Omos! What the hell is Omos doing? Omos is attacking Samoa Joe! Oh my god, the tree slam on the outside of the ring! Why? Why is Omos doing this? Omos just laid out Samoa Joe. I have no idea what's happening here.